Today I want to talk about why the rapture must be soon. And I'm getting my evidence from scripture. Let's read Matthew in chapter 24. But as the days of Noah were, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. For as in the days that were before the flood, they were eating and drinking, marrying and giving in marriage, until the day that Noah entered the ark, and knew not until the flood came and took them all away, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. So I think this scripture is talking about the rapture. Those who followed God got on the ark and were saved from the flood. The rapture will be like the days of Noah. Marrying, giving in marriage, eating and drinking refers to business as usual. And this is important to note that Jesus will come when it's business as usual because of the scripture as evidence. It's not, he's not going to come in the middle or the end of the great tribulation period. Because it's in the days of Nazan, the days of Noah, were carefree days. So, the Great Tribulation is going to be the worst time in human history by far. Multiple times worse. And we can see it lining up right now. Wars and rumors of wars, crime... disease, so many ways. We see that AI is there to identify people, record what everyone's doing. They want to record every dollar that's spent, all the money that's spent. They have the capability and the technology to do that now. The current, the current situation is not sustainable. So once the Great Tribulation happens, there cannot be business as usual. I'll give you some examples, or I'll give you the, the seals that are opened during the first half of the Tribulation. And this is not the worst of it. Number one, the Antichrist will be revealed and he will try to explain away the rapture, saying it's aliens or whatever thing they lie they come up with. We've seen over and over how people are eager to believe lies that makes things easier for them. Second seal will be war. Looks like it's going to be World War III. We can see the, the sides lining up. There's people, there's countries that are looking to expand their borders. And then they're feeling like right now, because of a lack of leadership, would be a good time to do that. The third seal is a big famine, probably caused by the war. The fourth seal is called death where a quarter of the population is destroyed. That's not business as usual. And there's a fifth seal, <clears throat> those martyred for their faith. A lot of people are going to convert during the tribulation. These are not people, Christians, that are around right now because they're going to be raptured. Just like in the days of Noah, they were taken away in the ark. There's other scriptures to support this. Check out other videos. Check out my other videos. And get it settled in your mind. It's so critical right now. You do not want to be around for this great tribulation. And there'll be a, such a great delusion. And people will fall for it in the, at the cost of their souls. But... The fifth seal, the people will be martyred for their faith. They'll be killed. 
because they did not take the mark of the beast. And those that do, their soul will be lost. And like I said, there's more seals and then there's the bowl judgments in the second half of the tribulation. These are far worse. Diseases, total collapse of the environment. So why must the rapture be soon? Like I said, the, the situation right now is not sustainable. We see that wars are coming. They're escalating now. The situation in the Middle East slowly getting worse and worse. Economic collapse is coming. There's debt everywhere. Nations owe money. People owe money. Control over all the people is available through AI for anyone who seeks it. There's the technology is out there. Only God is holding them back right now. He won't do it forever. So if you are not a Christian, accept Jesus right now. Every person needs Jesus because we cannot earn our way to heaven. It's not a matter of, did you do more good than evil? If you did any evil during your life, and we all have, and scripture supports this, for all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Scripture supports it. You must receive Jesus to get to heaven. And there's only two paths. The other one is to eternal damnation. I can't bear to think about anyone going there, but most people are going to go there. Please get this settled. Check out my videos, other videos, until you get all this settled. 